everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be reviewing the candy sky palette from laura lee los angeles this is a collab that laura lee did with her niece erin weaver i am super excited to play around with this palette it is so gorgeous if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and let's get into the video so i'm actually going to try and recreate the same exact look that laura lee did to her niece erin weaver when they came out talking about the palette but before i get into putting eyeshadow on my lids i need to prime my lids so i'm gonna go in with mac painterly paint pod and i'm going to just grab some of that and i'm going to put it on my eyes then i'm going to pick up the lightest blue shade in the palette this is sky blue and i'm going to use a small blending brush this one is the morphe m456 brush so what she did is she just kept this like in the crease and kind of on the eyelid a little bit so that's what we are going to do this blue is so pretty so next, I'm going to go in with a bigger fluffy brush so I can kind of blend it a little bit more. She didn't do this, but Laura Lee is like a professional when it comes to makeup, and I'm not, so I have to. I just want to blend out the edges a little bit. So next, she went in with a blue raspberry up here, which is just like a shimmery blue shade. And she took a flat brush. This is lavish Eye shading, eye shading brush. I'm, I'm not even sure where I got this. And I'm going to pick that product up. And she said with this one, pack it on, like just push it on and don't blend it or you will get a lot of fallout. So we're just gonna keep this on the outer part of the eye. I actually didn't get any fallout at all. So then next, I'm going to go back in with my fluffy brush and I'm going to kind of blend them together. Like I'm going to blend the crease a little bit and I want to go out to the outer corner and kind of blend it a little bit. Okay, then next she went and used some concealer to cut her crease. So we're going to do a half cut crease. I'm just using the Morphe concealer. You can use whatever concealer you have next what she did is she went in with this a light purple shade right here and it's called ebug and she just took another flat shading brush Pick that up and then she put that where we did the cut crease. Can you see that? That is looking amazing. So then she went in with the purple right below ebug and this is macaron and she just took her finger to apply this one and then she placed it on top of the purple. So that's what we are gonna do. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I don't know if you guys can see this. This shade is beautiful. Here, this shade is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Next, I'm going to go back in with my blending brush and this has a no product on it. And I'm going to kind of a blend everything a little bit more with then she went in with this white shade right here it is called marshmallow and she used that as an inner highlight oh wow 
Now we're going to move on to the bottom lash line and she went in with the sky blue shade right here and she just blended that underneath the eye a little bit and that was it. So that's what we're going to do. So now I'm just going to go and put some mascara on and I will be right back. Okay, so this is the eye look right here. I have to say that I love the palette. It's not normally a palette that I would go for because it has a lot of color in here and there's not really a lot of looks that I can do that would be like more natural every day neutral looks but for like a color palette I think this is amazing it's a very pretty like pastel shades and like I love it I am in love with this palette they also came out with a two lip glosses the first one is e bug and this is like a nude with some shimmer in it I think we're gonna do both of them so let's try e bug first So eBug is a clear gloss with a little bit of gold glitter in it, but when you apply it to your lips, you do see some of the gold glitter, but it's not bad. Like it's very wearable. You could wear this every day. The other one that they came out with is a Strawberry Sky, and this one looks like there's no glitter in it. This is what Strawberry Sky looks like. It is just a clear gloss. There is absolutely no shimmer in it whatsoever. I think this one is my favorite. I love their gloss formula. It's not sticky whatsoever. It makes your lips look like it's just they're wet and juicy looking, but not sticky and it almost feels like you're not even wearing anything on your lips. Oh. Overall, I really like this collection. I am not someone that normally likes colorful eyeshadow palettes, but I absolutely love this one. I think the reason why I like this one so much is because they're more like pastel shades, and that's more my jam. The two lip glosses are amazing. Like I said, you don't feel them on your lips whatsoever. Like it just feels like moisturizing, but your lips look very wet and juicy and just very nice. I like them a lot. I feel like you could wear them alone um, over lipsticks, lip liners, however you want to do it. These are amazing. So, so like I said, I'm going to be doing a giveaway in today's video. I'm going to be giving away a both of the lip glosses and I'm also going to be giving away the Candy Sky eyeshadow palette. So one lucky winner will win all three of these products. All you have to do to be entered into the giveaway is be subscribed to my YouTube channel, like this video, and leave a comment down below how I can get a hold of you if you win. I'm not sure when the giveaway will be over, but I will leave it on the screen here. It will be one week after I post this video, and I'm not sure when I'm going to be posting this video, so like I said, I will leave it on the screen and everything will be in the description bar down below. So check that out for all the rules. Yeah, everything that I have on my face today, I will also have linked down below just in case anyone is curious and wants to know. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys like it and yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!